Hello there. Hey, loot. Hello. Welcome in. Welcome in. Hello there. Go ahead and give you a quick shout out. How is it going, loot? Hope you're having a good day. So I'm having a bit of te technical difficulties, and um, you guys will have to give me one second. I'm trying to get my my stylus to work, and it is not working. And I don't like that, no sir. I don't know why it's not working. I don't know how to, like, reset it. Pretty good, and you? I'm actually doing pretty good. I'm actually doing pretty dang good. Um, thank you for, yeah, thank you for asking. Had a good day yesterday, went to the farmer's market, got some good groceries. Alright, this was working earlier. And it figures that it's not going to work now. Well, I see how it is. Turn that off here real quick. Let's try removing the whole little unit. And we're going to disconnect and remove everything and plug it back in. Yeah, I had a really fun time yesterday, actually. Got some fresh local veggies. All the good stuffs. Why is this not working at all? All right, then. And try a different USB port. Well, that shouldn't be it. Up, 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 up. All right, there we go. Different USB port did the trick. Wait, literally shut up. Wait, what? Why do you want me to shut up? Oh. Sad Zoidberg. Oh, that reminds me, remember when I told you they harvest maple sap and we only drink it because we don't have enough? Well, it seems like our trees feeling generous with sap, so we have almost two liters made. Aw, oh, dang! That is a lot. Alright, let's go, guys. I think we got it. I think we got it. Lulu, I will not shut up. But just for you. Just for you. You know what? You know what, Lulu? Just for you, I will. Baha. Thank you. 
Oh, hacking. <laughs> Lulu, 89% a gremlin. Let's go. Here's a problem. Here's a problem. So, I was cackling. I was cackling. And the problem is, under a certain volume, you, my microphone won't pick up anything at all. So I got to like full on like, <laughs> well, for my microphone will pick up the fact that I'm actually laughing. So well, trust me, I was I was having a giggle fit over here. Heck, an eighty nine percent a gremlin that is very fitting. You got a lurk. Oh, Lulu, thank you for the lurk. I appreciate that. Loot is only five percent a gremlin that tracks. That tracks. You can only go up from here. All right, want some valuable information? Yes. What? Hmm. Apparently there's a fountain right here. Okay. Yeah, let's go. How is everybody's Thursday going? I hope everyone's having a good Thursday. Oh, I remember this challenge. I remember this very clearly. We have to mark. There's one here. And... Wait a second. Wait, 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 wait. No! Sorry, puppy, puppy, puppy issues. I muted the wrong thing. I was trying to mute my mic and I muted the game instead. That was my bad. She uh, hopped up on my bed and was about to go to town on my bowl, what was left of my bowl of pasta, so. That was my bad. That was definitely my bad. Oh no! Whoa, this this lady just decided to stand right between me and the mailman. This is a letter from Astrid. Nahem. Ooh, I can't wait. Good tidings to you, Link. Well, thank you for your recent help. I try as I might to express my gratitude in words, I cannot do it justice. If there's anything that I can do in return, please stop by the Isle of Ember. I know that someone of my modest means might have a little to offer, but I believe that I can at least show you the way should you become lost. Sincerely, Astrid. And that's the end of it. Got all that, sir, and then I'm out of here. I like how the mailman reads you his mail, like, reads you your mail, like, is that... Is that... Not, like, privacy issues? Anybody? Have you entered the foggy passage to the north? Yes, I have. Now, what you do, it seems like there's no way through the fog, right? Every time you brave that accursed fog, you'll be sent back to your original spot. The Romanos who lived on the village edge had a father who got through it. No one dares try to figure it out, not since the ghost ship was seen in the fog. Mm. Yeah, Heidi's a good girl. Heidi's a good girl. That was that was my bad. I just had to stop her before she started pumping down on what was left of my food. Yeah, yeah. 
What? You want to sail to the island up in the Northwestern Sea? My husband called that place the Isle of Gust. He used to talk about how he had visited that island. My husband was once content to be a fisherman until he left this place. He sought to uncharted lands. At least that's what he said when he finally left. He refused to work, instead ruining his boat by braving the northern fog repeatedly. Last time we saw him was over a year ago. My son Romanos, at home right now, might know a little more. Hmm. That boy hasn't worked in a long time either. He's peeved at his dad, I think. He might get upset if you mention the Isle of Gust. That sounds like a him problem to me. Need something, kid? What? You want to travel to the Isle of Gust? Please don't tell me you're going your own way, too. Yes. Oh, really? Do it your way? Go your own way? What a bunch of garbage. All this endless babbling about living with a lust for adventure. Can that put food on the table? Can that make your family happy? Going your own way is no way to survive in this life. My way's a lot better. Stay at home eating cheese. That's the life. This guy's got it. This guy's got it right here. He's got the right idea. Hey, Amdor. Hello. Welcome in. At that six month sub streak. Let's go. Thank you for the sub. I appreciate that. Let's go. Thank you. I can appreciate that. How is your day? I hope you're having a good Thursday. Yeah, I love Gust. Don't say another word about it. Sir, I wouldn't dream of it. Break it out yourself and get out of here. Boy. Just finished packing. Nice. Let's go. I hope that you have a wonderful vacation. Young man. You mustn't go into that cave. Dangerous monsters have been seen there lately. Ma'am, I have a sword. Does not qualify me for dangerous monsters. Now be a good boy. Don't go anywhere near it. Ma'am, I am the danger. What are you talking about? Let's see, let's see. Just the weekend and still have work tomorrow. Oh no! Hacking rude. Hacking rude. Nope, can't buy anything from her. Yep. It's still nice to chill away a bit. Yeah, I bet. It's always nice to take a couple days away at least. See new sights, new faces. All right, bud, I need you. Sorry to unload all that on you, kid. It's just that my dad used to say a lot about going his own way to explore. I got fed up with him. My dad used to talk about getting through the fog and seeing the Isle of Gust. He said something about a specific route for getting through the foggy passage. But only he knew which way to go. There's a cave behind our house where my dad used to escape all the time. He called it his hideaway. You might find more details in there. But it's dangerous in there, so take care of yourself, kid. I will do, my good sir. I should stream streamer, then platform once to- yeah, right. Yeah, if you take a break as a streamer, then it does not- does not go well. Oh, wait, well, if my son has said it's alright, then go on in. There's no stopping you, is there? But please, don't do anything too dangerous, ma'am. Again. You see these eyebrows? Look at these eyebrows, look at them. Look, look, look at my war face. That's my war face, look at it. I mean business. Let's go. My first order of business is to slay the monsters. Alright, so... Oh! Well... Hmm. I wish there was a good way to play this game with a controller. But there is not. I think I could play this with a mouse, can I? I 
I really don't think I could effectively no I'll see. I don't really think I don't I don't think I could effectively play this with mouse, so. Oh, I forgot about this guy. I don't like this guy at all. Hang on. Um turn turn on, please. Where's my mouse? Alright, there we go. There we go. Oh, I remember back in the day when I had my first FIFA 97 playing on one PC. Oh, really? Man, FIFA 97. Hey, 20 rupees. Let's go. I'm playing keyboard, other with just mouse. Oh, I love when they used to do that. Yeah. So the way I'm playing this is I'm playing this with a basically a drawing tablet, and it's it works, but it's not the ideal way to do this. That makes sense. Most terrible though, I bet, I bet. They used to do quite a quite a few multiplayer games like that though, if I remember correctly. Sir, you got in the way of my bomb. Ah, right, so we're gonna take this over here and yeet. Let's see what's in here. All right, let's go. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh, we got the shovel. All right, so how do we switch our items? Um, what button is our item button? All right, that's that button. No, that's that button. Aha. Ooh, we got a hundred whoopies. Whoopee. My journal. I'm writing this while in a private space I call my hideaway. Whenever I'm here, I find myself utterly at peace. And it will stay that way only as long as I know that no one will interrupt me. Now, I do have one more hideaway and no one will ever find the entrance. It's under the spot where the lines drawn between my stone tablets intersect. It's brilliant if I do say so myself. Well, sir, the oh, secret is a secret to no one no more. Okay. Let's go. And I ran. I ran so far away. All right, there was a shovel sp Oh. I guess we need a drink of water. All right, so we're gonna dig up this. Ooh, another hundred rupees. Also finished watching JoJo's recently. Oh, nice. Let's go. Is that a JoJo reference? Um, it's funny how English version has so much. I'm gonna say censorship. I mean, besides gore stuff, it also changed a lot of characters. Really? Characters that were named after music bands. Apparently, there were some. Pro oh, yeah. Copyright issues in America are. Notorious. They will... Don't want to have copyright issues. Alright, so if you look at our map here, so we can say... There's another tablet right here. So it should be right here on this wall. If I remember correctly. That is not the button I wanted. Alright, there we go. Cool thing is now we can dig. I am a dwarf in the diggy diggy hole. Oh no, my emulator's broken. Oh, this is not good. I mean, it's not bad, but it's not that great. I can't see where I've already dug. Well. Um, I think we can survive, though. We're missing, apparently, a lair. Oh, uh, there's a lair that's not being rendered or emulated. Alright, let's see. Alright, here's the last one. 
Hey, first words number four. What a discovery. On the Isle of Gusts, the temple reached into the sky itself. But a temple to what? For whom? My curiosity must be satisfied. All right, let's take a look at our map. And so there's this one right here. And see, so this is going to actually intersect right about here. So we're going to have to dig in this area. So we can erase a little bit. And grab our pen again. And we're going to sit, it looks like, right up. About here is right where we're going to need to dig to find the other hideaway. So, our map away. And let's start digging. I don't know if this is actually true or not. Ah, right there. Whee! Example is one character who stayed the same name. I laughed out loud when the ancient man and godlike creatures talked with other and he called, got called. Wait. Oh, ACDC. Oh no, I love that. My son Romanos. If you're reading these words, you have found my true hideaway. Which means you also have developed a desire to find your own way in life. I know that I'm truly sorry for putting you and your mother through so much. I'm well aware that I'm the world's worst father leaving you both behind. There's so much about the ways of the world I don't understand. Such as why the ghost ship appears and steals people. Where do its victims go? I have decided to dedicate my life to finding out the answers. If I have failed to return, please take care of your mother. And please, forgive me. In closing, one more thing. Embrace your wayfaring ways, my son. Oh, too bad that um, I found it first. All right, let's go. So now we've got this map here. To my son, here's the only way to sail through the foggy passage. Bring up our sea chart. We can do 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 do. Wee. Oh. Wee. Wee! Gotta do some loop de loops and gotta do the thing. <laughs> Father! That was a good scene. That was a good scene. I remember that. Alright, let's go. Oh, ooh, we can go this way. No. Oh, there's a strange sun bum on that door, Link. I wonder if we can open it. Try touching the door, Link. Sounds like a prank. Mm, that didn't work. It's not opening. But there's something about this crest that tickles my memory. Hey, why don't I try this emblem on your map so we can remember it later on? Uh, you know? Sure, why not? Um, C chart. We're going to open this up here. Draw ourselves. Basically, it's a little circle. Um, with a bunch of star bits on it. Yeah, that's what it looks like, guys. That's exactly it. Uh, I'm an artiste. Yeah. That is a 10 out of 10. My best artistic rendition of anything I've ever done in my life. There we go. Yoink. Now we can go this way, and we can go talk to our friend. Is he really our friend, though? I don't know. He was pretty mad about his dad, so let's go talk to him. See what he says. Oh, you found my father's hideaway and defeated the monsters in there? Hmm, I see. Oh, man. Chapel, welcome in. Welcome in, Raiders. How is it going? I hope you all are doing well. Welcome in. Thank you so much for the raid. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Hang on. Did I just? No, I did not. Okay, we're, we're good. We're good. Uh, it's gone? Oh, no. What were you all playing? How was it going? Thank you so much for the raid, everybody. If and, and anybody that's new here, my name is Sebastian. I'm a variety streamer. I like playing Zelda games, Mario games. You were playing Hollow Knight? Let's go. Let's go. I'm sorry I missed that. I am so sorry I missed that. Steve the Weeb. Hello. Welcome in. Welcome in. So good to see you. Oh man, I didn't realize you were playing. 
Hollow Knight. It was terrible. It Hollow Knight is hard. Um, I'm I I I was playing through it. And I took a bit of a break just because I got to like every raid that has no shadows nor legends. Oh no. Um, no, I give you mad respect for at least attempting it. You got to green path. Okay, I think I got to, I think I got to green path as well. I clicked on your stream and I think I saw one segment before raid happened. Oh heck! Oh, I love that. Okay. Hollow Knight is amazing. Hollow Knight is amazing. It's a, it's got a really good mood. It's got really great music. I love the atmosphere, but boy, is it tough. Yeah, welcome in everybody. Yeah, no, you'll get it though. You'll get it. You'll get the hang of it. It's it, like I said. Don't. Uh, d d you 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 got this. You got this. Yeah, thank you so much for the raid. I heck and appreciate y'all coming in. We've been playing some. I've been playing, basically we've been playing some Phantom Hourglass. Oh, you don't plan to finish it. Oh no. Last time I played it, I finished my Still Soul playthrough. That was so fun. Heck, I do plan to finish it eventually. I gotta get back to it as well. Yeah, you must finish it. You must finish it. It's apparently one of the greats, but I know as far as platformers go, it is a tough platformer for sure. It is relentless. But I will definitely I'm definitely gonna go back and wanna watch that VOD because I wanna watch I wanna watch because I will I mean not gonna lie, I struggled a bit with it too. Lemon curls, welcome in, welcome in. It looks and sounds so good though. It does. It's beautiful art style, beautiful music. Yeah, today we've been it's it's a lot like Metroid. Um, in that way. Well, I mean, it's a Metroidvania. Deb said he'd play Xenoblade if I'd play Hollow Knight. I'm, I, I, I will, I will keep with that. If you can finish Hollow Knight. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. You're like the genie. I think maybe I chose my words, my words poorly. You did technically play Hollow Knight. Hmm. My intention had been if you'd play through it. All right, but anyway, anyway, yeah, I will, I will start looking out for, I will start looking out for Xenoblade and see if I can find it, like when I catch it when it gets on sale, stuff like that. Still so means if you die, you start over from the beginning. Oh, oh snap. I did not know that. I could not imagine doing that because I died so many times. I mean, you got the guy, I call him Bob. Um, you got those little grandfatherly looking dudes that just like, they've got the, they're like knights, they got their swords, and I realize I'm actually describing probably half the enemies, but you know, it is tough fighting one of those guys. I died to those like six, the mosquito, yeah, the mosquitoes even, they'll get you, they'll, they'll get you for sure. Hey, Jacob. Hello, welcome in, welcome in. So nice to see you. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you for the follow earlier. I appreciate that. We were hanging out playing a little Fortnite earlier. So good to see you. Yeah, so we're playing some Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass today. Inspired me kid what drove my dad to go his own way like you. Oh, I might just join him and find out. Thanks kid. So we are playing, basically it's a DS game that I am emulating on my computer and uh, yeah, so we are, we were just visiting the town. We're trying to get up to the, uh, if I can get the right button here, hang on. I'm playing on an emulator, so none of these buttons really make any sense to me. All right, so on our C chart, this is the island where we started from. And I don't mean to actually tap on it. We started in this island. We made our way over to here. And we def got the Isle of Ember. We, we beat that temple. We got here to get our get a, a cannon. We tried to go up to the next uh, quadrant of the map. We couldn't get up there yet. So we came down to this island. 
So now we have learned the passage to get through up to here. We can go follow all this long, and we can traverse through the through the fog and get to this island right here. All right, let's go. Platformers are my thing. I like to play everything by Excel platformers. Same. Platformers are my favorite. You never played this one? Yeah, this one's a lot of fun. Spirit Tracks is also for the DS, and it's a slightly more fun in my opinion, but this is a good one. What? You actually know how to reach the Northern Sea? The route was written on the map, was it? Please tell me you wrote it on our chart. Did you write it? Yes. When we shove off, then the fog awaits. 161 photos? 161 photos? Oh my goodness, that's all the photos. Yeah, that's gonna that's gonna make for a, a, a brilliant photo uh, book, though. I recently, I st also started this game when I'm in a recent. Nice, nice. Did you have to download a sound file for blowing into the mic? I did, I did to, to defeat the, the the. Who knew the the freaking candles would be the hardest enemy in this game? It was, uh, but I was very glad that they had that. I want, I want, I want, the, I want the froggy. Hey, we got the froggy. Ooh, you got me. Nice shot. Oh, why do you have to shoot me like that? See you around the pond. Thanks, bud. Hollow Knight is my first platformer. After I rage quit it the first time, I rage quit Mario Odyssey. Platformers are not my thing. Heck. So Hollow Knight is, I would say, probably uh, probably the worst platformer to start with if you're going to be looking for a platforming game to start with. And Odyssey probably also not that not that good. I'll be doing this book for the rest of my life, right? Mood with 160 photos, 161 photos, dang. And talk mom into waiting to give it to her so we could get some of her prom, graduation, and last band photos in it. Oh, let's go. That is going to be such a fun and such a wonderful memory for her when she when she when she gets that. And that's I, I agree. That'd be a good thing to wait for those because those are those are huge life events. Why do I keep doing this? Okay, cancel. I need I want to draw this nicely in one. There we go. Now we should be able to make it. Go. Tasha, hello. Welcome in. Welcome in. How is it going? I hope you've all had a good Thursday so far and had a good Wednesday yesterday actually had a really good day yesterday and it's actually it was a beautiful day yesterday here and it's a beautiful day again today currently painting stuff for seth's room awesome oh so heckin cute what kind of stuff are you painting come here you locked up dude oh thank you for the heart Oh no, I love those emotes. All the violence. Mother. I crave violence. Enemy side of the where oh oh fun fish bird thing just swooped down and attacked us. Okay. Please tell me we're almost there. Oh no, we're about halfway there. Yeah, if you're looking for if you're looking for a platformer to start with, I would highly recommend something along the lines of Super Mario Land. Or 
I wouldn't even say something like Donkey Kong Country. I feel like those are good places to start. Because they're more forgiving platformers. Because even something like the old Marios, they're not very forgiving. Because Mario's physics in a 2D platformer oftentimes will be very slippery. He will slide back and forth. Yeah, Hollow Knight is very unforgiving, and that is a very that's a very hard platformer to start with. I mean, even like I play almost exclusively platformers and that's my favorite genre of games, and Hollow Knight is beat me. I got three canvases. I'm going to do one with Harry Potter silhouette, one with Doctor Who TARDIS, and I think one with Lord of the Rings so Oh, Oh, those are gonna be amazing. I can't wait to see them. I hope you post them on the Discord once they're done. That's gonna look so amazing. What a TARDIS photo in my room. Look, we made it. We actually made it. We made it through the fog. Look at that sun against the sky. It's so bright. I heard Harry Potter. I have been someone. Yes. Asha is making some pictures for Seth's room. Got Doctor Who, Harry Potter, Lord of the Rings. Yeah, that's going to be beautiful for sure. Hogwarts Castle is silhouette for canvas. Oh, I love that. Woo, we finally made it to the aisle. But this sure is one gusty aisle. Yep, surely this has got to be the Isle of Gust. But you little green parrot, how about you go fly off in search of our next spirit? I'll do that, sir. You always stay here by the boat. Beware of great winds. Sir, do you have a... Alright. Hmm. This is a very gusty all. So if I know, right? Let's do that. Oh! Oop. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Oh no. I remember this part, and I remember not actively enjoying it. It's just because this tends to happen. Strong wind warming. Don't get blown off. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. I got blown off. Amazing how different the Boca Blends look in this game. Oh. Hey. Got a courage gem. Wayfarer's journal. You never know where the wayfaring ones will take you next. After months upon this windy isle, I discovered smaller islands nearby. My big discovery, the one that sets my heart to flutter, a mermaid. <gasps> Ooh, I like mermaids. That is where my wayfaring destiny takes me next. Alright, so if we look at our sea chart. And mark. Um, right about up here, there is a chesert. A, a treasure chest. There's a treasure chest there and a treasure chest here. 
Hey! Senny with the R2-D2 scream, let's go! Welcome in, how is it going? Hello, hello! Welcome in, welcome in, how is your day so far? Thank you so much for coming in and stopping by, I can appreciate that. Going good, how about you? It's going pretty darn good. Uh, we're just playing some Phantom Hourglass and trying to defeat these little both of them buddies. And having a bit of a fit at the same time. Got a lurk though? Oh heck, no worries. Penny, thank you so much for lurking. And Madge, thank you so much for lurking. I heck and appreciate that. And thank you again. <gasps> thank you again for the raid. Cine with 300 bits. Heck, I'm doing the, the drive-by bitty raiding and running and what the... Heck, I appreciate that. Thank you for the biddies. Get some hype in chat. Let's go. You are too heckin' dang sweet. I tell you what. Thank you so much for that. Oh, let's go. Hold up a second. Isn't this the way I already went? I feel like this is the way I already went. This is the way that I already went. Oh, that's a shortcut back. Okay, we don't want to go that way. Let's go. Oh, I love that hype emote. Whoa, I almost fell off there. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, time to fight all these. Let's go. Ooh, another chest, okay. Another treasure map. Wee, 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 woohoo. Oh. Wait, how's this supposed to work? What do we do up here? Oh no. Maybe we go this way. No? What? What time are you free to head to bed? Long day ahead of me? Yeah, no worries. Amdor, thank you so much for coming in and hanging out. I happen to appreciate it. And I hope you have a wonderful night and I will see you again soon. And if I don't catch you in the meantime, enjoy your weekend and have a nice trip. And thank you again for the sub. I happen to appreciate it. Whoa ho ho ho. Amdor, the phasmophobia attack. Let's go. I can poop at me before you leave. Let's. I. Okay. Oh, there's a sign right there. We gotta do that thing. We gotta do a thing first, looks like. Butts on the ground. Looked like they were shoveling with dirt. Okay. Well, that makes sense. Unfortunately, I cannot see these little things you're talking about.
because my emulator does not emulate that layer, and that is a little bit perturbing. So we're just gonna have to guess. Up oh, there we go. There's that one. Got a power jump. All right, there's that one. Link, Link, ah, oh, Link. Not that hard, sir. I right, can go this way. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, that just takes us there. Oh, right, we gotta cover this one up. Okay, that. Ooh, five rupees. Hey, we had 777. Now we have 778, but you know, close enough. Uh, we can go up here. Uh, let's see, what does this want from us? The hero must blow on the three sacred windmills to open the path forward. Why's it gotta be me, though? It have to be me. All right, so there's one. Um... This one. Need to blow on that one. We need to blow on these two. Alright, so let's beaten this up just a little bit. Okay, we can go back and go back. I'm about to figure this out. Yoink! Yoink! What you got to say, buddy? Boing. Creatures that are sensitive to sound dwell in the sands ahead. So walk without sound and bring as little attention to yourself as possible. Follow spells, flee to a high spot before the creature finds you. I will do my best. Okay, so we gotta walk. Loody. walk without sound, guys. Oh! I did not walk without, I did not walk without sound. Alright, we're just gonna make a mad dash for it. Run, 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 run. Ooh! Alright, that's mildly terrifying. We got the sandworms. Why is it always the sandworms? The sand creatures devour whatever they find. Go so feed them bombs. They don't have a chance of survival. Duly noted. Duly noted. Oh no. Run! Ooh! Just made it. Is this the right one? No, this is not the right one. We need to be at this one. Whoa. Alright, now if I can remember how to do this. All right, there's one. Run, run, Link. Whoa. -hoo -hoo. It's not this one though. We gotta be all the way over here. Run, Link, run. Whoa, okay. All right, that's the second one's right here. Is that so terrifying? All right. They opened the door. Door of the Explorer? They've opened the door, so door of the Explorer. Okay, all right, anyway. Oh, I got sneeze. Let's go. I was gonna try and get the heck out of here. Woo -hoo -hoo. 
All right, so which way are we going? We need to go all this way. And the Temple of the Wind. We're finally inside. Looks like we won't escape sudden gusts inside the temple either. Be careful. We'll do. We'll do. I remember this dungeon. This one's a lot of fun. Confusing, but fun. Let's just eat the bomb down there, why don't we? That Link. Link. Link, that's not that's not how this works, buddy. There's a way that this works, and that's not it. Up oh, there we go. That's my boy, Link. Tells me we're gonna get a bomb bag out of this level. Oh, just froze for a second. Okay. Why is this lagging? I don't like this. Hang on. Whoa, we're getting some lag on the emulator. Don't know why. Side. Oh, I can. Okay. All right. So I've opened up this shortcut. Back to the entrance. You. All right. We're gonna head up here. Oh. Link. Link. Oh, Link. Can you not? I swear, guys, I am a good gamer, usually. I feel like. There we go. Um, items and boomerang and quickly. Thank you. I love the boomerang. Such a good weapon. Yeah, we're opening up all kinds of doors. Now, this looks like a trap. If I ever saw one. One of these has got to not be real. Oh, really? They're all real. Okay. Most unusual. Hang on. Bring you back, my friend. It's always a trap, right? Exactly. It's a trap. So, what do you have to say for yourself? Buying the number of treasure chests left here is one. It'll cost you 20 rupees to see where the treasure is. No thanks, friend. I'm good. The real treasure with the friends we made along the way. Ah, wait, hang on. Hmm. Oh, that's right, we've already been that way. I'm, I'm curious, I'm curious. Is there, what button is the items? What if we dig like right here? Will even let us? Oh, we can't even dig in this here area. Okay, so it's fine. We're about to fight some more monsters, though. And where? That's what I thought. Pick it up, pick it up. Well, all right, that works. Just 
total utter destruction. That's always one option. There we go. Open sesame! The doors have been opened. Now, I feel like this might be a fake wall. Like, one of these I feel like has got to be a fake wall. Or this isn't a Zelda game. Plot twist. There's no fake wall, so it's not actually a Zelda game. What? See, this is where this map starts getting confusing. I do remember this dungeon. This, this Zelda actually has some really well laid out dungeons because they will get you turned around. It's, it, it's not just a linear strategic, you know, go here, do this thing. It's a, uh, what level am I? Where have I been? Which, how do I get back here again? It's, they're a very open-ended, they're a very open-ended sort of puzzle. A courage gem. Let's go. Okay. Like this right here. Like, how do we do this? We got to get over to here. But like, what? I don't remember even how to begin to do some of this stuff. All right. What does this say? When two wings flutter, the door will swing wide open. Okay. So we got to get up here somehow. First, we gotta figure out how to get up there. Yeah, I might have goofed up slightly. I might have goofed up slightly. Ah, hey, bud. Oh, wait. Um, nope, nope, that's not gonna help us any. need to do is take this, open this up. I think that's what we need to do. Yep, there we go. All right, got it. Okay. And now we gotta go down here. Is there anything else we need to do before we go down? Okay, nope. Time to head down the stairs. This has a torch that we need to light. Definitely use the boomerang for that. There are two chests left here. It'll cost you 20 rupees to see where they are. No, thank you. Actually, hacking. you know what? 20 rupees for two chests? I can afford that. Alright, tell me. Um. Uh, there we go. There's a chest there and a chest there. We got a flipping run. Ooh. Oh, 
All right, so we need to open up all the pillars of wind, which is annoying. Because we've got these little sand creatures that just want to devour us. And so we got to try and get around them. Let's see what we can do. So we're going to need our shovel, I think. Problem is, this is gonna be the problem. All right, run. The problem is that the texture is not actually loading. And so there's a good chance we're gonna die. So there should be a texture in here that gives us a hint of what exactly we're looking up. Oh, there's one of them. Okay, good. Oh, dang it. See, we're going to run out of health before we do all this. I reckon I can, like, defeat some of these, could I? Okay, good. So don't just continue to respawn. There's just, there's, like, three of them in here. Okay. That will help us. No! Oh. Well, maybe they do respawn. Yep, seems they do respawn. Okay, well. Where is it? Gotta be right around here somewhere. Nope, there it is. Okay, good, 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 good. We found it. Getting closer. Oh, man. Oh, 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 oh. Should be right here somewhere. Stop it for a little while. Oh, out. Oh no. 
No! Well, dad nabbit. Butter me up and call me a sandworm's meal, because I just doid. Ay, ay, ay. Not fun at all, not fun at all. Not the worst thing in the world, but... It's an odd bug, though, that the emulator is not rendering in the uh, the correct texture for the tops of where we've dug. And I don't know why or how to fix that. Maybe when we take a break here, I'll take a peek at it. Oh, that's nice. Okay, it remembered which ones we've already done. All right, that's good. That's good. Let's see though, can we, let's look at our emulation menu and see what we can do. Emulation settings. I don't think that any of these are really going to help us at all. Oh! The soft rasterizer does show it. Okay. Alright, there we go. Let's see, now we're not getting that same buttery smooth 60 frames a second because we're not using OpenGL, but hey, at least now we get to see everything. Because now I think if we, we could also enable the HUD for a minute. Yeah, because see, now we're doing intense, intense CPU usage. I'm getting massive CPU usage, so... Sixty frames a second. Oh, that's right there. It's still... No, no, we're tanking. Yeah, we're tanking. Alright, there we go. Door should open now. Let's try something here though. I'm curious. Where's a place that we can dig something? Let's dig like right here. See if maybe we can fix this. So the software rasterizer works, but that's a massive use of the GPU, so, or CPU, so if we go here with the software, say emulation, we can say view, HUD settings, um, turn off input. Turn on some of these. See if they make a difference. Ooh, that almost does. That's yeah, funky. But then we can kind of see where it's supposed to be. Yeah, it kind of breaks a lot of things though, so.
I guess something we're just gonna have to live with. Alright, well, yeah, we'll live with it. Let's go ahead and turn this back down to two. And turn that off. There we go. Did we get some odd frame drops now? Ah, oh, let's go. Now we can make it. I just have to do this without falling off. All right, that turns on that one. That is a start. Uh, the question is, how do we get to the other one? It's the only way that I know of to get to the other one. Actually, I have no idea. There's one more of these guys right here. Alright, so... We look at our map. We... So far, we've been this way. Basically, we come in this way. We come up and around. We come down. Go over here, we climb up to here, go through here. This takes us downstairs a level. And that takes us downstairs. We then come through here. All the way across, come up here. That takes us back up a level through here. Now we've done this. Now we need to get to this side. Question is how? Do we... There is this room that we can get to. I don't know if we can get to that yet or not. Probably worth a shot, so we should probably try to get back down to this floor. Let's go ahead and back up the way we had it. Oop. So satisfying to erase everything. All right, so let's go back and let's figure out where we need to go. Now the trickiest part is we don't have a key to open this yet. Oh. Oh no, this gate is open. Okay. There we go. This is where we gotta go. Oh, look at that. There's a hundred rubies in here. All right, let's look at the map. Right in here somewhere, there is a bumble wall. We should be getting a bomb bag soon. I can feel it. I hope, man. Hogwarts is done and I'm on Discord. Oh, it's on Discord. Oh, heck. Let me go take a peek. Oh, I love that. Let's go. That is amazing. I love that. 
That's gonna look so cute. That's gonna look so good on the wall. Aw. It's gonna be so cool because Seth is gonna get to grow up with all this cool stuff. That, you know what, tell me. Aha, uh -huh. right here's a chest. We have a lot of blues and stuff, so it'll work. Awesome, let's go. Thank you for sharing that, I love that. I can't wait to see the others. I swear, in our community, the sheer amount of creativity and everything that I feel like everybody has is, is amazing and I'm here for it. Let's go, we got a key. And hop on to it. I'm curious about something. Um, I would like to see CPU load average. Do I have, okay, no, nope, no, that's not it, but CPU. All right, there we go. Now that we have the key, now we can go over here and open up this chest, which should be, should be, I think, our bombs, I hope. Also using Dollar Tree paint, so they're not the best. Hey. I would not be able to tell you are doing an amazing job with them. You got the bo bombs. Let's go. Yeah. Show these guys what for. Got all the bomby boys. All right, let's go. Oh. And that they still couldn't save me. No, please don't eat my bomb. I said, please don't eat my bombs. Those are meant for the wall. Hey, there's a hundred rupees in here. Let's go. Why do I feel like we have a mini boss fight coming up ahead? I could be wrong. Let's go, got that door open. Yep. All right, no, actually it was not a mini boss fight, but it was on a timer. Dealing all of the damage to myself. Blank faces can hide truth as well as blemished ones. Study the walls carefully. Ah. Yoink. That way. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
think you little tube guys are coming from. Now, Tasha, you are doing a fantastic job, and I wish I had that amount of creativity. Whoa, 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 whoa. Probably a texture on the wall here that we're missing. Oh no, it's right here. Okay. More bombs. Aha. Uh -huh. that door. This should give us the boss key. You found the boss key! Okay, so we can go down here. Take a look at that map, though. Where do we need to be? We need to be... Ah, oh, it's tempting to go down there and get those coins, but we need to go this way. I don't like this. We're about to fight a fight. I don't like fighting fights. I just want Princess Zelda back. Step into the blue light to return to the temple's entrance. Uh, one thing I need do need to do, because I had completely mucked this up the other day, I need to... Um, save the state file. Probably wouldn't hurt. We're going to put that up here on our desktop, I think. Save that, replace that. Because if I remember correctly, to save... Shift 1 is to save it. Alright, so it's saved. So now if we hit... Command... Yeah, we go. Okay, that's good. Let's go! So I don't remember much about this one. But I think it's going to be a bit of a pain. It's Cyclops, Stir of the Winds. ruh -ru. That bloated beast could summon Cyclones, I noticed. What? What? Wait. Whoa. What are we looking at? Oh. Yoink. You just took that chest away. Who are we fighting? Why can't I see them? Oh, it's because we're looking up here. Oh, got it, got it, got it. We are supposed to be looking at the upper screen. What with this being a Zelda game? And oh, we just got yoinked. Yeah, my game is not liking this. I think we both got dizzy right there. Wah, wah, wah. All right, not so bad, not so bad. I wish one of these would work. All right, we're gonna need some more bombs, please. Um, I will take a heart, but I will take some bombs. So three bombs, okay. 
You, he tried to knock me off that edge. Yeah, the game's stuttering quite a bit because I'm trying to render... This one uses both the top and lower screen for this fight. There we go! Let's go! One boss fight down. That's more sands for the sands of time and the phantom hourglass. You got more sand for the Phantom Hourglass. Two minutes have been added. Let's go. And now we should be able, yes. We've got the second fairy. Neary, the spirit of wisdom. Thank you for slaying that vile monster. Now the seal has been broken and I'm free. Look, Link. This time it's the spirit of wisdom, Neary. We came all this way to seek your help. The Ocean King must be locked up somewhere too. The spirit of power is with you. Of course I'll help. Let's go. Spirit of power and the spirit of wisdom. So all stuff now is the spirit of courage. The spirit of wisdom, Neri, has joined your group. Find one more spirit to track down the ghost ship. Let's go. Ourselves a heart container. And now we can get the heck out of here. Sorry guys, I don't got time for all this. I just want to get out of here. I want to go home. Get me a juicy juice. And take a nap. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. What's up, Lineback? Well, well, Link, you did all right, kid. Looks like you held in another spirit, eh? The Temple of the Ocean King, then. Let's set sail. Let's go. So, I think what we'll do, though... I feel like this is probably almost a good time. Um, once we get back to this island, let us go ahead and take a break. These are excellent for farming rupees with. But we lose them once we end it. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and go back to Merkay Island. They had a really cool way of, of rendering these to where it made it look like the island was coming closer is by basically they take the same geometry and they just kind of like push it up out of the ocean. And it's a really nifty little trick and I really like that they did the way that they did that. Hey, 
we should be just about at the port. Let's go. Oh, hey, what's up, friend? The shipyard is up, but if you have ship parts, take them in there. I want a tip that will give you an edge. Sure. Now that you, gr that you grip your equipped item by tapping the item icon, you can also press the LR buttons to... Oh, I already knew that. That is what I've been doing, my good sir. The tropical ship ship part. Ooh, we're customizing our ship now. Come well, on you found yourself on the shipyard. Want to customize your ship? If you got the part, I got the time. Let's go. Um, we are going to start needing to start collecting some parts, but we have a different hull now. We do have the tropical ship hull. I'm going to attach that. Oh, it does not like rendering that. All right. All right, so now that we've done that, we can start making our way. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a quick break right here for just a little bit. Let me go ahead and let's see if I can get my words on stream to work real quick. And then I will be back here in just a little bit. I'm probably gonna take like probably about 10 minutes. I think I need to... Um, grab a little, some more water to drink, grab a snack. And don't forget, if you guys have it for a little bit, don't forget to get up, grab a snack, stretch, do all those good things. And let's see if I can get back over to where's OBS. And... Edit this real quick. I wish I'd have this every single time, but it is what it is. All right, and I will be back, everybody. Uh, let's get inside where the chickens aren't clucking all the time. Is this thing not working now? Huh. Well, my tablet's not working now. That's not good. All right, I'll be right back, everybody.
Hey, let's go. Welcome back, everybody. All right. Oh, heck. That's strange. Comic should work. Oh, there's only one C. <sighs> you guys see it? Spelled it out. Let's go. Yeah, there's only one C, so comic won't quite work there. Nice. All right, let me turn off the autopilot there. Yeah, all right, so I am back from break. Welcome in, Falcon. Welcome in. I hope you're having a wonderful Thursday. Uh, oh, that's right. My tablet would not stay connected, and I don't know why. Uh, let's see if we can get this to behave again. Technology just has a weird way of being... finicky. Let's go, Tasha, with the 14 points. Falcon with the 12. All right, so we're going to go to in-game here real quick. But before we can continue, I need to... Uh, I know, I know. Yeah, before we continue, though, I need to try and plug in, in my... My tablet because it's no longer working and I don't know why. All right, now it's on again. Let's see what is the what does it say for the battery level? Like I whoop 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 whoop. Whoa. Not sure what's going on. It's 95% battery mode. It's got full battery. It's just being a derp. All right, so now that we're back, though, we should be able to hop on in. All right, so what we got to do now is head back to the... Words. Words are hard. I don't know what we're trying to do. We're trying to get back to the water. Apparently, we need a we need a quick bath. All right, now that we've done that, I have to get back here to the temple. So, let's go. So now that we have bombs, we can make this a little bit, a little bit faster, which so should be nice. Wait, hang on now. Oh, we still gotta go this way. Get up there. We gotta bomb him from the other side. And I'm out of bombs. Rude. Oh, that's fine. We'll get some more bombs in here in a little bit. Uh, just notice the map looks like a dragon that is looking back at its tail. Wait, really? You know, that's actually a really good point. I never noticed that. Um, that's actually really cool. I've not ever noticed that before. Alright, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Well, now that we're back, let's see. Hopefully some bombs in here. Yeah, I got some bombs. Okay. We're actually going to head back outside. Because I want to go... There's a couple things back here that need to be bombed. That's look like the iron nostril. They do. They really do. I love that. Alright, so we're going to detonate that. Oh, that was a waste. Well, it's whatever. Alright, so that's open. Go ahead and open this one up. Not the rats! What you got for me, buddy? 
following. A three fallen adventurers number forever within the Temple of the Ocean King. They have fallen, but you can seek their advice on how to survive the temple. Oh, that's good to know. A power gem! So, the other thing, though, is... In here... Is an eye. That we need to shoot with an arrow once we get our arrows. We need to be able to shoot this. I don't think we can do anything with it until then. Break time is over. Back to work for me. We'll be lurking. Okay, no worries. Thank you so much for coming in. Lurking Falcon, I appreciate that. And I hope the rest of your workday goes well. All right, we're going to head in here. Alright, so we should now have 12 minutes. Okay, we've got 12 full minutes to get through here. Now that we have bombs, it'll also make it a lot faster for us. Hopefully. So, we need to get... I think where we need to be. Yeah, see, we can't do anything up here yet. All right. Uh-oh. Ah, oh, we're doomed. Oh, my goodness. Dagnabbit. All right, well... Ay, yeah, 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 yeah. That's not what I wanted to do. Okay. All right. So one way that we can speed this up, though, is by no nope. taking that that way. We gotta run. Okay, that opens that up. If I get to make it back we're here before we wrap. Yeah, I hope so. I hope so. We'll probably be playing for about another I'd say probably like another hour or so. I am the big sleepy today, so probably may not play the full four hours I usually do. Oh hey, we have a shovel now. We have a tool for this. I guess it's some bombs. Okay, good. Oh, we can... Wow, okay, we don't even have to... We didn't have to do any of that at all. Um, we've got bombs for this now, so we can go bombs and put those over there. Um, we we didn't have to do any of that, which makes sense. Oop. So that cost us two minutes, but we're doing okay. We're doing okay so far. key there. Opens up that door there. Okay, we're good. We're good. Gotta keep on. Oh, my word. Okay, we gotta keep moving here. I think that's a problem with wall. It is. 
That gives us some time up. We can't get through there though we, until we have bomb chews. We don't have bomb chews yet. So. Let's turn that off. I wish there was a faster way to do this. Oh, down. X. Okay. X is what we're looking for. X is our items. Okay. That'll save us some time when we're swapping through items. So, that next phantom is coming. Just need to wait for them to turn around. Getting here to stop the timer. We still have 10 minutes left. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to put my, my go live message today on Twitter. Um, I'm pretty sure I forgot to do that last time too. Oh, uh, there's a little pumpable wall right here. I keep forgetting that. All right, so. I got the key. Throw that up there. There's a bumble wall right there. Again, it would save us a lot of time. Um, getting through here. So I gotta remember that for next time. We basically went through the old way. Now there's a much newer, faster way. This one's gonna be a bit tough. This one's gonna be a lot tougher. Oh. Oh, snap. Much pain. Alright, so we need to... change to the shovel. Alright, that, that saves, makes us safer there. Oh! Oh, I just did the thing. Alright, we've got a key. Out. Do we have to do this whole thing? We may not even need to do all this now that we have bombs. I forget. I think we do, though. I think we do. Um, we're going to go ahead and change out for the bombs. That can get us a time uh, extra 30 seconds. So this one dungeon right here, this one dungeon right here was, I think, the biggest complaint that a lot of people had about Phantom Hourglass was simply that it takes a hot minute to go through these because every time you're going through you gotta you gotta do the whole area again from scratch I'm like we've already done this before but it's usually not so bad because each time you do it, there's more, you can be more efficient about it because you've got new items. Now, at this time, I'm just not doing it quite right, but I wish I would stop pulling this thing up here. There's a way to turn that off. Uh, this one's about to see me. Is 
the key was right here. What does this do? Oh, okay. So we don't have to worry about that anymore. Which, I mean, basically we didn't. All right, we still have nine minutes left out of our sand timer. And we should be safe to go at this point. Let's go. Hey. hey, listen. We've made it to the door. It's the Spirit of Wisdom's turn this time. Oh, leave this to me. This is the door of wisdom. I will use my powers to open it. Are you ready? Then tap the door. Let's go. Awesome sauce. All right, so now we're good to go. Um, I wish there was a way to get to here a little faster, but... Now, the question is, there's a little door right here. Can we take this and get anything out of here? Uh, there's 30 seconds right there. Hang on. Is there something in here that we can come get? Nope, that just takes us, leads us back down. Okay. Don't need to be going that way. All right, so... Oh, we've got the drones. I greatly dislike these drones. Eyeball monsters. Let me explain. These are phantom eyes. They act as extra eyes for the phantoms. If one sees you... Yeah? What happens if one sees you? The phantoms will find you, and then it only gets worse, so be cautious. However, unlike the phantoms, these creatures can be defeated. Find them on the map. Make sure to defeat them before they see you. I get it, so you have to find a way to hit them before they see you. Well, let's get going. Be sure to go to a safe zone if they see you, Link. Will do. So we're going to switch to our boomerang. And then start making our way downtown. See, so right here is a phantom eye. That one's defeated. Uh oh. Rut row. Uh oh. Ah, oh, I hate when this happens because then it's, I forgot about that. It spawns in another one. Are right, we safe here though? Chest. Okay, good. Don't know what that does. Hey, power gem. Let's go. Okay. Let's take a look at our map. We gotta get in here. Um, there was something bombable, I think I saw. Yeah, it's right in here. So we need to switch to our bombs and chuck one right here. That 
That was up this door. Alright, we're in the safe zone. Uh, you can't see me. Yeah, what is everybody else up to on this uh, Thursday? It's a beautiful day here. It's like 77 degrees outside. Um, very nice breeze. It's been rather hot lately, so I, I like like the cooler weather, but that's too warm. It is. It is awful warm, but like 77 is been pretty good. It was 90... 95 a couple days ago it was it was hot welcome back city and welcome back yeah thank you again for coming in and hanging out and lurking i appreciate that use your items wisely to earn more time if you come through here again talk to me i'll teach you something valuable for stopping by aha uh -huh. i'm gonna sneeze about 45 50 here and only like 44 where you are tasha dang it's chilly where you guys are yeah, it's already like early summer here, which I mean, I guess that's technically what spring is. But yeah, the fact that it's already up to like almost 100 degrees is intolerable. All right, let's see. Where do we got to go now? We have to get, I think we have to get uh, right here. So make a mad dash for it. Go, 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 go. Erase this. Yeah, but it's been, it's nice. I will take it. I would prefer for this time of year for like 45 to 50, but dang. All right, let's see. Let's take a look at the map. What do we got? Um, this is opening and closing. Basically, it looks like we have to get this way. And probably through here this time so let's see what we can do so go this way can't do anything with that oh didn't think so all right so near boomerang oh that opens this what does that open then Oh, more time. Good. Refill on supplies. It's like a little supply closet. Good, good, good. Oh! Oh, I don't like this. Um... Alright, easy peasy. Easy peasy. My quick work with the boomerang. Ooh. Give us a little bit of extra time right there. Another fight. Link, attack. What are you doing? This is swinging wildly at the opening. It's supposed to, like, it should be targeting it. Alright. Got that. Hopefully that gives us another 15 second pot, I think. Maybe. Yep. There's another 15 seconds right there. That's okay, Heidi. They're already gone. There we go. Oh, we're running out of time. I'm not standing in the safe spot. That was standing in the safe spot. All right. Oh, that opens up a chest. What does that give us? Ooh, another potion. 
Yeah, we can't go that way yet. Ah, <laughs> bork back. Bork, 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 bork. It's a little farther. The clue to the ghost ship should be up ahead. All right. Yeah, UPS will just drive by and she's like... <laughs> See, exactly. She's just like that whenever they drive by. That was a beautiful timing. Beautiful timing. Good girl, Heidi. Good girl. Ah. You're a good puppy. Alright, uh, what are we doing? What are we doing? That was the best timing. Alright, we need to take care of this one and this one. So we need our boomerang. And we need to take care of this one. So we need to go all the way down. So there's a clue to this, I think. Before you lies the second tablet governing the crest. Um, this one is two. There are four stone tablets that govern the crest. All right. Good to know. Thank you. Before he lies the fourth. Okay, so we up our map here. This is number four. Okay, so I'm back. I had to clip it. I don't know. Thank you. Thank you for clipping that. That was beautiful. That was some of the most beautiful timing ever. Oh no! Wait. What? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. Woo! Wait, what does this one say? <gasps> oh. What? Oh. It's a cursed tablet. Rude. Hey, you didn't see nothing, buddy. Alright, so we need our items. We need this to dig. We need this to explode. Oh, hang on. We get up here. What is up here? Run, Link, run! All right. Ah, that tablet. Okay, got it. Ah! The sacred crest both begins and ends with me. Discover the crest, and the way through the door shall be revealed. Okay, so that means we can look at our map, and you're going to be one, comma, five, which means you're going to be three. We can, just for formality, we can go ahead and activate that one. We should probably defeat this one. If we can try. Yep, so that's going to be the third one there. And just like that one. Where is our friend? Right here. Oh, he just teleported out. Hex! Ah! 
Pick that your eyeball. Alright, so... One, two, three, four. Basically draw an hourglass. Easy peasy, right? Who would have known? Drawing an hourglass in a game called the Phantom Hourglass. Alright, I'm gonna sneak on through there. I think we're safe now? Yeah, we are safe. We had 5 minutes and 23 seconds left. We're actually not doing too bad. Hey, it's, it's that, it's that uh, symbol again. Press the sacred crest against the seat chart to transfer it. The Temple of Courage will open to the holder of the Sun Key. Now, this is where it's going to be tricky because I don't know how this is going to work. Um, because we... All right, we need to say... First of all, we need to say save... All right, we need to pause it, execute, maybe, open up the C-chart. Uh, wait, we need to go back. All right, so yeah, I need to open up the C-chart. And then we need to put the console to sleep. And so I think we can, might be able to do it if we pause it. And then execute. Will that count? Not. Um, I might need to see, figure out how we're going to do this because I need. How are we going to do this? You know, I need to look this up because in the real game, what you would do at this point is you would save the game or you would pause the game. And that would be effectively by putting the, the closing the lid. Oh, it's the lid key. Okay, so we need to modify some settings. So preferences, input, and let's see. It is a lid key. Where is lid? Backspace. Okay. All right, console's asleep. Open the lid again. And we've now transferred that mark onto the map. Awesome. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Wow. Thank you. Figured out what it meant by pressing them together. So the cool thing is, so since this is the top and bottom half, obviously of a DS, what would happen is you would close the lid and effectively smashing the two screens together, transferring the mark from the tablet onto your map. It was it was really cool at the time. You know, it was a it was a neat idea. The crest is here. All right, we should go ask Lineback what he thinks. All right, we'll go ask Lineback what he thinks. Yeah, they really thought it. They really did. They really did. 34% a gremlin. Let's go. 96% a fishy. Let's go. And only 21% sus. Today is a good day. I feel like that's like perfect amounts of everything. Only a small bit sus, exactly. Oh, we've got uh, a letter. 
A special delivery. Watch out, incoming. This is a letter from Edo at Cannon Island. Ahem. Ready for this? Hey, you, Link. I've got some very big news. Big, big news. See, I've been working on a salvage arm for a long time, but now it's ready. This gorgeous piece of machinery lets the ships pull up treasure from the seafloor. I'm going to sell this thing to the first one who gets here. Ready, set, sail. Who's going to be the lucky customer to claim it? And that's the end of it. Got all that, sir? And then I'm out of here. Sir, why are you reading my mail to me? Hand me the envelope. Hey, what's up, sir? Uh, no. Uh, I just got mail about that. That's a 75% sus. Only 12% a gremlin, but 70% the fishy. Let's go. Get it out the fishy. Everybody did the fishy fishy to do. Let's go. Everybody's all fishy. I love it. I love it. Let's go. Alright, where are we going to though? Where are we going? We are going to go... Not here, but we're going to go... Straight away. Because I would like to buy the salvage hook. You got me. I shot, but why'd you have to shoot me like that? You're around the pond. I don't know. You're just such a shootable guy, I guess. I don't know. Alright, let's uh, head in on this way. Go buy ourselves a salvage arm. Will you let me go this way now? What's up, Edo? Yes, yes, it's finally complete. The salvage arm will let you reach the bottom of the sea for sunken treasure. What? Aren't you the shrimplet who bought that cannon from me? Now you want the salvage arm? You come racing over here after getting one of my letters. <laughs> you dropped everything to rush here for my invitation. You're a real fan of my work, aren't you? Yes, I am. <laughs> Butter me up all you want, but it's gonna cost you big time. So, show me how much you want the salvage arm. Shot with some gusto. Want the salvage arm? Then make your voice ring out loud and clear. I'll decide your price based on that. Okay, go. Thankfully, I don't actually have to shout into the mic. What? What was that? I didn't hear anything. You know what? No sale. If you really want the salvage arm, then shut like you mean it. I thought that I, that's my shouting button, though. I was shouting as loud as I could, sir. Oh, no. Am I not going to be able to buy a salvage arm because I have no way of emulating a proper microphone? I am shouting, sir. Can you not hear it? I'm just going to let this play for as long as I can. If only there was a way I could actually tie the actual internal microphone to the game. Uh, I will have to do this off stream, probably. I'll have to figure this one out. All right, no salvage germ for now. Don't think it's mission critical. Oh, I think it might actually be mission critical though. Once we get out here to the sea, I think, I think we actually do need that arm. We're gonna have to figure this out. Hey, Connie, hello, welcome in, welcome in. Tasha is a sus fishy, right, exactly. Yeah, welcome in, Connie. We are playing The Legend of Zelda, 
A Phantom Hourglass. It's a, uh, ow. It's a Legend of Zelda that was for the Nintendo DS uh, almost about 10 years ago, I feel like. I feel like this is, a. Uh... When was this game come out? I don't even know. Yeah, we gotta go back. Okay, we gotta figure this out. All right, we're gonna have to figure this out one way or the other. Yeah, hello. How is your day going? I hope you're having a good day. Oh man, my ship is on fire. Let's see if we can figure this out. All right, we're gonna go back up. I might have to try. There's two. There's another sound file that we can use. Worst case, if you guys want to bear with me a little bit, we can always record our own. All right, so come here, buddy. Oh, there we go. Three hundred rupees. Uh, I think you can say no one more time. I think it'll knock it down just a little bit more. It's funny now that it's working. Why is it not working now? Okay. I'm on. It was working before. All right. Well, we're going to figure this out. Come on. Come on, buddy. All right. Well, I see how it is. I see how it is. You don't like how much I'm shouting? Trying to think about how long we have to press the button to extinguish the candles. And that's how long I have to press the button to make this work, probably. One, two, three, four, five. All right, all right, 300. We'll take, we'll take up 300. We got the salvage arm. Let's go. Okay. I'm doing... Oh, Appa, Hogwarts, and TARDIS. Oh, let's go. Appa is perfect. All three canvases are done. Awesome. I will take... I cannot wait to see them. All right, let's go. I like those choices. Those are all three amazing choices. Appa would be such an amazing friend to have growing up. All right, let's head this way. Seth is going to have such an amazing childhood, I can tell already. You are going to be an amazing mom. Let's go! Alright, so we're here now. Now, what do we do? How do we do this? I think salvage. Yep, salvage. This part, I barely remember. Remy thinks I made Appa look like an alien, but oh, oh no! We shall see, we shall see. Did you post it in Discord by chance? Use the salvage arm to pull that treasure up. Get the bar control and the arm at the bottom of the screen. Tap and drag this right or left to move the arm under the water. Move it up or down to just how fast the arm moves. But there are octomines down there that will explode if you touch them. Takes a steady hand to move the arm carefully and steer clear of them. Oh, you did? Okay. All right, give me one second. I will take a peek. Yeah, of course, of course. I believe that with all my heart. 
Oh, slow, slow, slow. Ow. Catch, we got it. All right. Time to eat. Careful. All right, not bad, not bad. We actually got this first try. All right, let's go take a peek while we pull this up. Oh, I love them. No, that is very, very clearly Appa. That is very clearly Appa. Oh, I love that. They look all so, they all look so good together. Oh, those are amazing. I love those. Also, baby bump, right? Let's go. I didn't even notice at first. Yeah, no, those are amazing. Those are going to look so good. All right, you got the sun key. This key is the same shape as a crest that you saw. All right. Eh, strange looking key you got there. Shaped like the sun, but what's that supposed to mean, kid? Well, I'm back. If I told you everything, then that wouldn't leave me anything to do, would there? All right, let's go. can take the, oh, that's not the eraser go ahead and you brace all all of this so we can tidy that up oh is this gonna work or we're gonna clip into that oh we just we just made it We haven't had to fight these guys yet. But we're getting close. Tomorrow's Friday! You're gonna leave work early? Nice, let's go! Come here, bud. That's right. Thank goodness it's Friday! Yeah, tomorrow we'll be playing more Terraria. Um, and then Saturday we'll be doing some Mario Kart. Next week is only four work days. And the week after, oh, you took the next week off. Awesome, let's go. That is hecking exciting. Oh no. What in the prana plant eyeball based creature? All right. Time to... I remember this part. Just make a bunch of loops. Around the island. It's like over. And over. And over. I know I can't wait to do some shenanigans. Yes, let's go. I would say that your eyeball... There we go. Or wait a minute. Oh, this isn't moving. Okay, we got a new new flight plan. Wow, 
Why is this putting us so close? Okay. Another new flight plan. We're going to go all the way out this way. There we go. What can the weak spot of this giant one-eyed thing be? Hmm. Hmm. I have no idea. Uh, I think we're too far away now. My goodness, if this ain't the Goldilocks thingy. Alright, this thing just wants it to be perfect. Right there, there we go. Please just let me poke this thing in the eye. I'm still too far away. I meant to go, I was too close. I don't know what this thing wants from me. <laughs> I love that. Eyeball in the lips. That is, I mean, that's pretty much it. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not happy about it. I'm not happy about it either, buddy. I guess technically I don't need to keep moving. I could actually just technically stop. Well, maybe movie does help a little bit. Poke, poke, right? Oh, well, I gotta keep going. Oh, this is never gonna stop shooting. There we go. Yeah, I love that. Poke in the eye. Oh no, ouch. Little finger poking in the thing. Too easy, right? Easy peasy. I'm back on Molita Island. And now we can head back into this little area. Where is it? There's a tree here. And let's get out a shovel. I think it's right here. Yep. Excuse me, excuse me. Aha. Let's go! And this takes us up to the back part of the island. Buying. Osha's home has a storehouse. That storehouse has a tree outside. And its roots had a buried treasure. Dig there. Ooh, okay, so we go here, go to map. Uh, no, wait, no, we need to go to our C chart. Items, nope, nope. Map, nope, nope, that's not it. Hang on, we'll get it. C chart. Tap on this island, and so there is a, a tree. I'll put a little X right there. Dig. If I can write. There we go. Let's go. Thank you for that. Whoa. Ow. That was going to be painful. Oh, that was painful. Why is there so much pain? All right. We need to swap out to our boomerang because then we can... So these guys what for? Only statues can urge the temple door open. So focus their light gaze on it. Oh, by golly, I remember this. Not. Ow. Okay. 
Alright, and then there should be one over here somewhere. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not cool. Oh, no. Drink the potion. Ooh. This is going to get spicy. Oh, is he stuck here? See, th they fixed this with the spirit tracks, and it was really good that they did. Because when you go to try and draw with the boomerang in Phantom Hourglass, it shifts the entire screen. So as you can see, so I want to draw to the north, and as I'm drawing to the north, that's fine. If I want to draw to the east, that's fine. But say I want to draw an L. Um, you guys can't really see my cursor, but basically you can see the fairy, right? Like I said, there's one, let's say there's, you can see there's kind of like a grid. Going on. So say I want to draw an arrow, it's like, whoa. Um, one, two, three, and three down, like right in here. If I stand here and I want to draw it this way, that's what it ends up doing. I can't, I wanted to, like, I was, with my stylus, I drew a straight line. But because the camera kind of moves with it, you got to slow down. And it takes a while to get that precision, and so it's kind of wonky. But in Spirit Tracks, they fixed that. There's that one. There's one more. There should be one more here somewhere. Yeah, it's tedious mechanics, yeah. Like I said, it's normally not that bad. But sometimes, like when you're trying to fight those guys, and it's just like, wait, hold up. I'm, I'm trying to aim there. Turn that one on. And now, the gate is open! Hey. What a place, the Temple of Courage, huh? I bet the Spirit of Courage is here. Let's keep going, Link. A lot of hearts. All right, we're in. And oh, whoa, 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 whoa. that's exactly Navi's voice. It is. It is. I, it tickles me. They they went and they they went and nabbed and pulled the exact voice from Ocarina of Time. Like I, I will tell you right now, that is not actually Navi. Hey, listen. Hey, listen. Exactly. I actually thought that was the game for a minute. Uh, they pulled Navi's voice right from the game, and... Ow. Did you see what that thing did? Navi is 68% sus. Exactly. If yeah, that was heckin' rude. Ooh, a pearl necklace. Alright. One percent miss. I know Nightbot keeps doing that. Does Nightbot do that on purpose now? Did they like change Nightbot to where it can't do a very nice number? I got a small key. All right, let's go. Where does that key go? I wonder. Um, keyed door, I believe, is this one. Okay, that's our key door. Room Nightbot room, right? Yep, there's the key room. Okay, so we can hop down, turn around. Nightbot is a 45% sus. Yeah, he very sus. All right, tell me, how many are there?
All right, there are two chests. All right. Let's go. Uh oh. Oh, I don't like this at all. Oh! Please stop following me. Oh, that's not so bad. Okay, that was... Alright, that was a lot scarier looking than it should have been. Like, I, it's, I'm kind of weird like that, I guess. I love, love spiders. I'm a huge spider fan. I do not like... And like, I also really like centipedes. I actually, I actually do not centipedes. I like millipedes. I don't mind the millipedes at all. Centipedes, bugs that look like that, those things, nah. -uh. No, thank you. Well, I don't think either of us won that one. No, just no. Yeah. Millipedes are kind of cute in their own way, because they got little legs, and they just kind of like march and they just do their thing. Centipedes are not cute at all. I heard though, I have heard that centipede moms are like some of the- Ah, oh, what the? I've heard that centipede moms are some of the best moms out there. Like, they're the most like maternal of like, insects. What, Link? Can you not? Blah, 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 blah. I Google millipedes. I wish I didn't do that. Oh no! I'm so sorry. I think they're kind of cute in their own little way. Little millipedes, the little ones, the little ones. There's the big ones. I'm not a huge fan of those either. Nightmares. Oh no! I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, this cannot be good. This cannot be good at all. My skin is itching now. Oh no! All right, duly noted. Duly noted. Will not. Will not uh, invoke millipedes on uh, viewers next time. Never liked bugs. Butterflies are pretty, but can stay the heck away from me. Aw, oh, heck! Speaking of butterflies... Um, there were actually some moths I saw at the store... ...yesterday, and this surprised the heck out of me, and they are kind of beautiful in their own way. But they were, they were kind of like, unlike any moths I'd ever seen before. And that, um... They looked like hummingbirds, the way that they flew. And they were really pretty, and I was like, whoa. Up, down, right, left. It's not only the order for the switches nearby. You up, down, right, then left. No, you're fine. I'm not that squeamish. Uh, skirmish? Skirmish is close. I think squeamish is what you're looking for. Uh, skirmish is close. Skirmish is what you do... What is a skirmish? I don't know. I know it's a thing in American football. But, um... Yeah, skirmish is a word. Skirmish is a word. Um... It's like a... Yeah, it's an episode of irregular or unpremeditated fighting, especially between small or outlying parts of armies or fleets. But it is a thing also, like, in paintball and football. They sound very close, though. It's the Order of the Whole Temple, so take note of it. So, they said that the Order of the Temple is... Up, down, right, left. So, that's going to be... One... Two, three, four. 
Up, down, right, left. Okay, one, two, three, four. So, da ba da, ba ba da, ba ba da. Hopefully that makes sense to myself later. All right, close this here. Oh, we got the, oh, I like the ship tower. Okay, that was really cool. Thank you for the free ship tower. Power gem. And then we have this thing. So this is for our map. It's easier to have courage to cross the void later if you know this path now. So we're gonna look at our map and we're gonna change the floor to basement two. So it's gonna start here. Go down. And then it's gonna come all the way over to here. Like that. And then come up, 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 down, and over like that. There we go. I brain mush both of them together. Yeah, exactly. English is weird like that. Uh, bugs are pretty fascinating. I don't like their looks, but scientifically pretty amazing creatures. They really are. They really are. My brain is mushed anyway. Yeah, bugs can be good, but stay away from me. Exactly. That's where, like I said, I saw these, like, hummingbird flying like moths. I was like, what is that? My brain was a bit confused and slightly scared at first until I was, oh, they're just, like, kind of, like, pretty looking moths. Get away. Be gone. Crystals can only fit into the same shaped platforms. That makes sense. That does make sense indeed. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, we opened up a shortcut. That's nice. One time we had flea. Oh, I hate fleas. Uh, one time my cat also brought fleas into the house. It is the worst thing ever. No idea where they came from and they... Whoa, 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 whoa. I know you don't like loud noises, but ha please, I'm trying to make a loud noise. Ow, why are you doing so much damage? Oh, you see the teeth on that thing? No idea where they came from, and they always only went after me, so I could sit down on the floor for a second and have two fleas on me. It was summer. I had 37 bite marks on my legs at one point. Since then, no to bugs. The thought of them crawling. Oh, oh no, yeah. One time, Heidi brought in fleas, and then the cats got them. And then, like I said, I had bite marks that left, like, little scars that just lasted for, like, six months. And it's like, nah, I'm good. Oh, loud sounds. That's what it is. There we go. That meant loud sounds like Lily with a microphone. Got it. All right, so we have another key now. Where does that one go? That'd be one of these doors up here. We didn't even have pets at that point. Really? That was the pet. At the oh, no. Oh, no. Please don't. I will cry. Stop hurting me. My blood must have been tasty, right? That's like me and mosquitoes. Um, there's some of my family, they will never get bothered by a mosquito, but I will get eaten alive. Oh, that's a Bemos. Don't know what that just opened. I have no idea what I'm opening. Pain. I'm opening pain. Oh, no, I'm doing it wrong. We got to do this in the order, the order of the dungeon. Ow. All right. All right, so up. Ow, please don't. Down. Ooh. 
left. How are you supposed to get past those things without getting hurt? Right, there we go. That just opens a chest for us. Ow! Please! It's painful! Aha! It's found the crystal. Mosquitoes love me. Right, that's the thing. Yeah. And my family would always joke that as long as I'm there, they're safe. Oh no. Oh no! Please do not. Um, we need to switch to a boomerang and... Thank you. Ooh! That's getting heckin' spicy. Oh, we already read that. Okay, so now I gotta do is now we can go down to the next level and hope we can survive. All right. Whoa! My screen just was like, nope. At least I've given you heart, right? Exactly. Think that you can't go further because there's no path. But you see isn't always a stone cold truth. For instance, take the wall between the tablets on the first floor. Mysterious. But am I telling you the truth? Who knows? I don't know, but this little dude... Looks like he's having a good time. I'd be having a better time if I could get this to work. Come here. Be gone. The mustache on the stone thing. I know, right? Was it, uh, I forget who. Was it you? So it looks kind of like Wario. Oh, oh. Yeah, little rude turkey. Nope, it wasn't it? Okay. Yeah, someone said they look like Wario, and I was like, you know what? You're not wrong. Get back! Get back! Oh, we made it. So glad we made it. I was thinking it. I love it. I love that. The number of treasure chests left here is three. It'll cost you 20 rupees to see what the treasure is. Sure, why not? All right. Bring up the mappy the map. We've got one here. One here. And this one here, which we're about to open. So we'll go ahead and erase that one. Go back. And we've got the bow and arrow. All right, so... Yoink. Hey, now we can walk wherever we want to go. Oh, that was satisfying. That was a very satisfying. Ah. I just trapped myself. All right, so we raised those. I did not mean to raise those. All right, so... I like how sometimes Zelda games will just troll you like that. Ow. They were less satisfying than your, than your siblings, but... All right. You are another crystal. Crystal needed here is the very same you needed elsewhere. Retrieve the crystal, then put it in its place here. Oh no. Ha ha! I am unstoppable. All right, we need to switch to our boomerang. All right, and switch to our bow. Oh, uh, where is that one, though? Be here somewhere. Uh, okay, good. Yep, 
keep it moving. Whoop. What just opened? Oh, door over here, I think, right? Yeah, there we go. What I love about this is that you literally just have to aim and point. Like, this is probably my favorite Zelda game for using bows and arrows and stuff. Because you know that point where you want to go, bop, bop, bop. It's just beautiful. Like, it's it's even better if you play it, like, on, an, on a DS or a 3DS. It's, a, it's, a, it's actually a lot of fun. Um, there's a chest right here, there's a chest right here, and a chest right here. Yeah, bop it, twist it, spin it, right? Technologic. Technologic. I still can't believe Daft Punk has stopped being a thing. Oh. Ah. That always confused me so much. What the uh, the boppet toy, or the <laughs> or the um, Daft Punk? Whoa. I would get stressed and mix everything, right? Yeah, Daft Punk was fun. They were. I mean, I guess all good things come to an end eventually, but like, dang. Please don't, sir. You are stressing me. Ah! The toy, the toy, yeah. Yeah, Daft Punk left a mark on them. They really did. Just like I'm pretty sure that bat just left a mark on Link. Yeah, that keys did a number on Link. Just like Daft Punk did a number on our hearts. Wait, what? Oh, no, you don't. All right, try that again. Now nah, Link can overcome everything, right? Just about. Look at those angry eyebrows. It's so heckin' serious. I think you're gonna get frown lines if you keep frowning like that. Whoa! Hey, Ollie! Hello, welcome in! Link dying always has to be so dramatic. It does! Oh, whoa, okay. Me up! Oh my goodness, Link. That's what you get, buddy. What the? What? I'm very confused, but I'm not gonna ask. Imagine there being a message from Link to the gamer after too many deaths and the line's like, Are you done? Right? He just like looks at, looks at the screen. Tune Link's expressions are- They are! They are. They're just too good. Thanks man, been here for a bit, but just been eating- Oh, let's go! What are you eating if I'm- uh, if, if you don't mind my asking? I am in a big mood for some food, I will tell you that. That's not even fair. Please don't. I- I am... Okay, that bombs do 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 bombs do 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 bombs do 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 bomb bomb bombs do 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 Chinese chicken styled curry. Oh, let's go. That actually sounds really good. Uh, 
Alright, come here. Hoppity hippity. Hippity bop. Ah, bippity boppity. There we go. Yeah, that sounds so dang yummy. That poor little spinny thing. I forget what those are called. But yeah, it's been a... Ooh, we got a Zora scale. Okay. It's been a hot minute since I've had um, anything curry. Trapped, right? Bop, 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 bop. Um, let's go ahead and swap back to our bow. Yeah, it's so good to see you. Thank you for coming in and hanging out and lurking. I appreciate that. We've been playing, um, as you can tell, we've been playing Phantom Hourglass, Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass, and I've been having quite a bit of fun. I've been emulating it, so it's, it looks a lot crisper than it would on a DS that's intended for. Um, let's see, we're gonna need our, our bow now. So it's good, tad bit spicier than I intended. Hey, that is, uh, this is the way, right? That, that is uh, the best way. I don't think this is gonna work now though. I think we, I think we done did goofed it. Yep, it hit the wall. It hit the wall. This is why this is so funky. Aha. <laughs> Tasha, thank you for clipping it. I appreciate that. I was trying to say, like, bombs do things, and then it's like, bah, can English. Come on, buddy. There's me wondering how you're streaming from a DS, but I forgot emulators exist. Right? I would love to actually stream this from a proper DS. Um, but the problem is, oh, you little turtle-based creature. You little turtle-based life form. Um, the capture cards that, that do exist out in the wild for DSs sadly are no longer being made for DS's and 3DS's and so they're no longer being made and so to get like a 3DS that has working capture cards on it as a working capture card they're like a I forget how much they're like a thousand dollars on eBay for one with a capture card it doesn't burn your whole mouth are you even doing it right it's not burning your mouth you're not doing it right oh boy No. Ah. One slight difference, though. There's one slight difference, though, with, uh, with the uh, emulators versus the real thing. The real thing won't accidentally rewind you about an hour back into the past. Re okay, well. Um what were we doing? Oh yeah, that's right. Um open up our seat chart. Let's try doing this again. Oh why did that happen? Okay, so I was trying to press Q and I pressed one instead. And for whatever reason, so pressing shift one will save a state, but pressing one loads the state, which I feel like is a lot riskier. It's, and it's right there. Q is a shoulder button. One right above it is to load the state. And so I loaded the state instead of using my boomerang. Yeah, I need to see if I can, like, reconfigure that. I, I can't, though. That's the thing. And so that's the emulator's button settings. It's like, I almost need to, like, disable that. Oh, mamma mia. Yeah, the, I mean, it's not bad. It's just, like, an hour's worth of time that we just rewound. I was going to cut stream as soon as we finished that temple, so I guess, I guess I will be streaming for the, the actual full four hours today. 
because I don't want to end on that note. What's in here? What do we got? Yoinks! The Teller of Treasures. Oh, that's right. He buys stuff from us. Never mind. Up time. Yep, yeah, three hours and ten minutes. All right, so we can we can probably get back. Oh, hang on. We can probably get right back to where we were. And then, um, then we'll wrap up. Did you add watch time? I did not. I did not. I gotta figure that out. No, I'm not talking to them now, man. I'm not talking to you either. Ah. So much stuff. We gotta go back and do again. Uh, yeah, I will. I will go back though. I will go back and I'll see if I can add a watch time. I'll look that up. Thank you for the reminder. Um. Because that is something I do want to add. Want to know how many hours you watch? Nice. Okay, let's go. Do you, okay. So question. I don't know if I'll be able to do a difference or not, but do you want to know how many t times you've watched total, or just in today's stream? If that makes sense. I guess I could have a separate command for both, if it's possible to do both. I don't know if it keeps track of total. Okay. I will see if that is possibly a thing I can do. All right, we are going to go. All right, I'm going to go shout at, an, shout at an old man. We are doing this the speed run way now. Oh, oh, look at me go. Oh, that's what it is. It's because I hit one instead of tilde. I'm trying to hit the tilde key to shout. Oi. All right, well, we're going to try that again. Did you hear it? Ah, no, you didn't even hear it. Okay, well, come on, buddy. I need you to hear me shout. All right, one, two, three, four, five. Can you hear that? You can't hear that. All right, let's try four seconds. One, two, three, four. Uh, bu 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 bu. Okay, what is all the theme? Let's go. Yeah, you you just missed it. I accidentally rewound by about an hour worth of gameplay. I am screaming into the mic, my good sir. Why can't you hear me? The game should think that I'm screaming into it. But he can't hear me at all. And I am the big annoyed. Come on. One, two, three, four, five, six. Try six seconds instead. Why can't you hear me? All right, we got to figure this out. All right. Okay, so emulation, file, preferences. We're going to go here to sound. That's not sound. General input. Let's see. Microphone settings. Put this over here. Now, just a heads up, I'm going to cancel my sub to you because it's on mobile. I'm gonna switch to PC because okay, oh heck yeah, no worries, no worries. Yo, grandpa got that cake though, right? Oh no, oh no. Yeah, no worries. I totally understand. I totally understand. I appreciate that though. I appreciate that. Google takes so much. I know. So does Apple. So does Apple actually. They take a bunch as well. 
Uh, let's go here over here to downloads and mic samples, noise loud. Let's try this one. What the? Where? I swear. Uh, 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 uh. Oy, 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 oy. Yeah, Google and Apple are both the big brood by taking in all that extra stuff. Are we sub Susan Ken? Okay, oh no worries. Uh, we need a new display window. Uh, hang on. Is it there? There's there it is. Okay. All right, now we're back. We're back. All right, but now we should be able to load in the now. All right, there we go. Now we're back. All right, function. I am shouting. Three hundred rupees. Deal. Got it. We're good. We're good. All right. Now we're gonna go back and save a new save state. There we go. Oi. Yeah, the emulator is just like no, not today. Now part of it is I will say that this emulator. Oh, oh no! Fuck with the sheep security. They can spook at me. Uh, this emulator has not really been updated at all since 2015. Like, no good updates. No, no, not no good updates, but no big updates for seven years now. And so, you know, as operating, as operating, as operating systems continue to evolve and, you know, programming changes, no one's updated this to really work with the newer code and newer APIs and stuff like that. You still do your micro camera streams? I do, I do. Well, it's been a long time. I will still. I, uh, next time we play like a Game Boy game, I will do that. Um, as well as I really, really want to, I really, really want to um, do another repair stream soon. Last from the past, yes. Right, we've done all of this today. We're just gonna munch right through it. Um, I have some stuff I, I can I can fix on stream, um, but it's stuff that I need to I need to get set up. Oh boy, the emulator is chugging. Nine months and one week, six days. Dang, Ollie, you are like one of my first followers. Let's go. Oh, oh boy. Ooh, go, 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 go. Wow. But I feel like you've been following. That's about how long. That's about how long it's been since I started streaming. Let's go. Yes, follow age. Yes, follow age does exist. Not watch time. Won't tell you how long you've been watching. I know, time flies so fast. City! Dang, it feels like a city. It feels like you've been following me for forever. Two months? Almost four months. Let's go. It feels like it's been a lot longer than that. I know, right? All right, let's see. We're going to take a route, and now we're going to do this again. Oh, we gotta fight that eyeball thing again. Oh, no. Nine months and three weeks. Let's go. Seven months, one week. Let's go. Awesome. Yeah, from day one. From day one. That's actually cool. So that means I've been streaming for nine months and three weeks now. Almost on ten months. I can't believe it, guys. That's when it was around seven ish months. Yeah. Hey. 
Second exciting. Yeah, I will. I've got some stuff. I need to figure out what I'm going to repair next. Three more months and you'll have an anniversary. I will. I will. Nice to see I'm still enjoying it. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, um. A few more. A couple more months will have my stream anniversary. I'm still deciding what I'm going to do. And I'm thinking about doing like a, uh, a 24 hour Zelda stream, maybe. Like a subathon type of thing. Maybe not necessarily a subathon, but like something like that. We'll do a 24 hour Ocarina time stream. That's what I'm thinking. It's a great community. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. You guys have made this so much fun for me to come in and stream every week and it's just amazing. You guys always support me. Show me so much love. Let's go. All right, we're going to map this back to see if we can do it again this time. Go. You could do 24 hours, but have different games too, like the community games and just everything. This is true. This is true. I've thought about that as well. I know a lot of people, it might be more interactive if I actually play like Mario Kart for a little bit. Play some Among Us, play some Phasmo. We can even play some Mario Party. Part of me is just itching to sit down and, and play through all of Ocarina of Time in one sitting again. But you're right, for a subathon, I think having the community day would probably be a bit more uh, appealing for viewers. Yeah, it would be a heck of a time. All right, easy peasy. I think one more hit and we'll have it. Oop, there we go. Dang, though, that was annoying. We got all the way through that dungeon. And then I... That fingered the keyboard. Alright, let's go this way. Get out a shovel. Boy talking to the mailman. There we go. I put us so far back. <gasps> Whoa! Ho, ho, ho. Heck and spooping me. Anonymous played Fastmo Ghost Jump Scare for five bits. All oh, heck. Oh, thank you for the five bitties. I appreciate it. Oh, the heck and spooked me. Oh, what's this? Oh, I know there's a chest up here. Oh, let's go. Thank you for that, though. I appreciate that. I love those sound alerts. I love those sound alerts. No, I didn't mean to go down. All right. Ever done that? I hope you have a lovely day, but also screw you. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, those are some spooky sound alerts. I've got a couple for you. Oh, I'm just going to avoid these guys this time. We're just going to avoid all of this this time. We're going to do this as fast as we can. Ow, ow, hey, hey now. Get your game on. Where's my cursor? I'm going to activate that one. Not me, I would never do that right. I have, a, I, had a, I have a feeling I know, I might have a small idea who did it. Maybe. Ow. God, that poor bird got stuck. Look look at the feathers that just keep falling off the the the, the uh, uh the crow. There's a name for crows in the Zelda universe. I forget what it is. Wait, 
What is the name for the Chrono Zelda universe? It's like a tell something. It's got like, oh, what is it? Oh, oh, that'll do it. Ninety four percent sus. Hmm. Hmm. I think Nightbot. I think Nightbot is on to something. Nightbot be snitching though. All right, guys. Can we speed run this? Can we speed run this dungeon? Can we? Can we get back to where we were? Night nice, support me for once, please. Right. Snitches get stitches. <laughs> and then you use the heart emote. Oh no. Oh no. Sydney, what are you doing to the heart? 77% sauce. Oh heck. And 34% a gremlin. Let's go. Alright, let's see. So now we're gonna have to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, we're putting the save state right about there. Oh, right about there. That heart's being torn in half, right? Exactly. I don't think they're hearts, Seb. Wait, are they not hearts? Oh! Are those boxing gloves? Oh, that's an entirely different meaning. Um, Fight me! Okay, so you... I will tell you guys. You guys are... Your all's chat is on a 15.6-inch monitor that's mounted vertically about two feet away from my face. And so, from here, I thought that was a heart you were holding, like my emote. <laughs> I never noticed that those were boxing gloves until just now. I love that. I love that. Slightly different meaning, slightly different meaning. I was slightly terrified by what you were doing with that heart, but now that I realize it's not a heart. Yeah, it's so small, you can't appreciate the cool... Well, I can appreciate... Some of them. I gotta lean in and really look. Ow. I love the water spritzing one, though. Yeah, um... I'll have to take a picture at some point of my desk setup. It's a little it's a little untidy right now. I'll have to take a picture of my desk setup so you guys can see what it looks like when I'm streaming. Uh we can go this way, take a shortcut. Oop. Right, I'm just gonna be saving save states like constantly now because I just don't want to accidentally do that thing again. Alright, I think you tell me how many chests there are. Why don't you go ahead and tell me? I've got some questionable most from other people's channels. Heck. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, my heart. I see another anonymous five biddies. Thank you for the anonymous five biddies. Ah, I didn't mean to talk to you again. Wow. It's just like, it's, it, it would be just like Wario's statue to acquire money to tell you information. Um. Where is my cursor? Here it is. There it is. Oh. <laughs> oh no. I wish my monitor was slightly smaller. I can see those two clearly. Oh no. Oh, I like that. Looks like it was a DJ. Yeah, it's a DJ Pepe. I like that one. Okay, no, we do need to go down. Okay. DJ Pepe in the house. 
Alright, Link, I need you to be chill. Hit <laughs> the credit card emote, I love that. Alright, I don't think we need to toggle that. Actually, I think we're actually fine. Oh, right, we can go ahead and draw this if I remember right. So, it's what? Is it like this? Like this? Like... Oh, wait. Wow, that's over the place. Um, we'll, we'll get back to it. Don't know why there's so many Pepe ones, right? Let's go into a summer friend again and all the panda. Oh, I love the panda emotes. Let's, oh, those are so cute. Oh. Yeah, the Pepe emotes are funny. Oh no, the Kermit, the, the machine gun Kermit. Emotes are so dang fun though. That's the thing. Oh wait, I didn't do this. Okay. Witness me. Okay. All right, we need to pull up our boomerang and boomerang a ring. All right, head up. Make this as quickly as possible. All right, so now we need to uh, switch to our bombs. Well, at least this is going quickly, right? Because we're not having to figure it out anymore. Ah, oh, the Ganon, the 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 Ganondorf. The Gandalf meme. I love that. One of my favorite memes. So many emotes. I know. Oh man, I like I like the other one better. Wait a minute. Is it by chance randomly generated each time we do this? Could I, in theory, get the shit part that I want? My brain's starting to get sleepy, guys. I am starting to get the big sleepy. All right, so I am actually very curious if this is going to work this way or not. So we're going to create a safe state right here. Open this up. It does. It's randomly picking. Oh, wait. No, maybe not. Nope, at this point, it's already chosen. Dagnabbit. Well, I'm not too, too upset with that one. Whoa, okay. I wonder when it decides, because that earlier, it hadn't decided yet what was going to be in that chest, because it then swapped it out. Um, I'm going to erase this stuff here. And... Take care of that guy. Yeah, we're getting really close to where we were. Because this is the chest, uh, this is that, that that thing we need there. Okay, that's fine. Open this up, that opens up this door. It's a shortcut door. We'll do a quick save. Um, pose voice. It does not like that at all. Get the key. I'm not even subbed to anyone, literally just by being gifted. I know, it, I, I do love that. There's so many wonderful communities on Twitch and a lot of people will, they share, they, you know, they share and gift subs. And so like, I'm, I'm subscribed to a bunch of people right now that, um, just by the sheer generosity of their communities. And I always love that so much. All right, let's take a look at the map, though. We have a key. I don't know where it goes. Um, map. Uh, this one right here. I should know. It was just here, like, 30 minutes ago. Wait, that's not a door. Oh, here it is. Don't get me wrong. I would love to be, but money's tight. That's the same way that I am. Um, I'm only subbed to a couple of people. Only because right now... 
Twitch is my only source of income, and as much as I would I want to be subscribed to a lot of different creators and streamers, it's just not financially feasible right now. But eventually, eventually I will. Aw, Cinny! Thank you for giving that gift sub to Ollie Isle. Aw! Let's go! Well, Ollie, enjoy the ad free experience, enjoy the emotes, and enjoy the sound alerts. Cindy, you are so heckin' sweet. Thank you so much for doing that. Let's go! Where does this go? Oh, it's a chest, I think. Yep, there we go. Oh, can I get some hype in the chat? Let me get my mouse cursor over here. Let's go! This fat, I'm getting another beer. Oh, heck! I love that. Yeah, it's been a hot minute since I've had a good beer. Alright, so now we get to go through here, take this next shortcut down. We'll be making our way back around. Oh, let's go. <laughs> oh, no. Teddy, thank you for the five biddies with the excited R2-D2. Alright, let's see if we can do this now without me falling into the abyss over and over. Oh, well, I fell into this. My German-ness approves. Let's go! Like, I'm not a huge beer or alcohol drinker, but... What? Oh. I probably should look at the map. Um, I didn't sketch it out this time. I'm pretty sure it goes here, here. I think it goes something like this. Wait, I did that anonymously. Why did I? Why I didn't do that? Oh no! It had to be you. Um. No, oh, get back. Oh, that one was a spoopy one. I didn't know if I was gonna fall off the edge there. Ah, oh, we made it. All right, so now we've got our arrows again. Yeah, what is your favorite... Frost, as we say. Oh, really? I never liked beer, LOL. I'm a disappointment. The only beer I would drink is mixed with Sprite. Ooh, ooh, I've never tried beer mixed with Sprite. My favorite is literally, literally either um, a Hefeweizen or a uh, pilsner. I like I really like light beers. I mean of course it depends what you it depends what you're going to have with it, right? You know, a light beer is not going to go with a stew, for example. But if you're having like a sandwich, a nice light summery meal, uh, a pilsner or a hefeweizen are my two two favorites. And there is actually one that was made in Germany that I used to be able to get locally that I really loved. Um, but they stopped carrying it and maybe the Big sad. A bitter lager. No, those are good. Those are good. Yep. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, I really love them. I just wish that the, the one that I was getting was still available around me. Um, all right. We need to switch over to our new bow. New. Oh, I'm getting... Okay. The sprite mixing is with Pilsner. Really? I will have to try that. I had never heard of that before, and I kind of want to try that. How do? You, how much do you mix it? Like, half and half, or...? Like, what's the ratio for that? My girlfriend loves pale ales. Pale ales are good. Pale ales are good. There are a couple I like. Um, there's a stout that I've tried before that I like. It's a really good, but... That's, that's a good, you know, with a good hearty meal. There we go. 
Half and half, but also depending on if you want it more sweet or bitter. Awesome. Okay, I will definitely have to try that at some point. All right, this is just about where we'd gotten stuck last time. Actually, no, we're not quite there yet. Why is that not... There we go. All right, we gotta go get the key from over here. Wow, he is standing on the edge. His little booties. Right over the edge. It's called Radler. Oh, really? That is so cool. I'm gonna have to look into that. I'm gonna have to try it, actually. I don't really need to look into it, but at least we need to try it. All right, we gotta go grab this block. Uh oh. Got the neighbor neighbors driving by in their golf cart. I'll plop that little crystal right there. We're getting closer. We have to go through that little mini gauntlet. Wait, I just went the wrong way. door just opened up. Um, this one right here. There we go. So... How dare your neighbor do that and disturb Heidi, right? There's a Polish bear I like called... I'm not gonna be able to pronounce that, so I'm not gonna try. Uh, my Polish friend would be able to pronounce that, but... He would tell me how to pronounce it. This is actually, ironically, this is actually where you came in. Which tickles me. Oh! As this is where Link has his many dramatic deaths. Ah, oh, dang it. Alright, there, that chest is poor Linky, right? No! Oh, really? Oh, it's too low for me to get to it. Um. We do have at least, we do have this. We can use this. Drink that potion. This is where I started talking. I came in when you kept falling in that part with the two moving blocks in the- Oh no! <laughs> oh man. Yeah, with with the stylus and everything, the way that I'm doing this, it is hard to judge when and where to tap. That is the only thing that would be nicer is if, uh, because I'm using a, like one of those drawing tablets where the tablet is down on my desk, but I'm looking up at the monitor, so I'm not exactly you know, I'm having to intuit where I'm tapping. Doesn't always work out the best. Alright, we need some bombs and Okay, we're gonna break that. That's right, we're gonna put this here. All right, all right, we're getting there. We're getting there. All right, we're not gonna trap that one quite so much this time. Got the Rudo Crown. 
some more equipment. Command shift one. Function shift one. There we go. Open that door. That's the next shortcut. Again. Okay. Almost. I just burped and all I can taste is curry. Oh no. Hey, curry is so good. I need to make some at some point. I don't know. I don't have all the spices I would need. All right, like maybe you can jump over here real quick. Oh, nope, he can. Never mind. Curry is good and Miss Curry, right? Same. It's good, but it's such a linger. It really is. Hurt the thing, but like it doesn't really give me a whole lot of a choice. All right, use that our bow and whoop. But it doesn't have a bad aftertaste. Some foods are right; they're they, they're pretty good. But when you burp, it's just right. It just does not taste like that anymore, and it's just like, oh, what was that? How does that work though? There is a thing over here. Oh, wait a minute. I have an idea. Um. Using our bow again. Time. And let's try using our arrow again. What is that on the. Oh, look, it's a hidden chest. Okay, awesome. I mean, that's pasta dishes. Not sure why. Oh, really? Interesting. That is. That is. Uh, that doesn't usually happen with pasta stuff. It'll happen to me with like salads, I think, ironically. This is where we messed up. This right here is where we messed up because I actually loaded the save instead of turning on the mic. So we're creating a quick save. Now we're turning on the mic. He doesn't like that. All right, there we go. All right, we finally made it back. It was almost uh, 50 minutes later. We're back to where we were 50 minutes ago. Pasta is digested too quickly for me to taste anything, right? Yeah, I heckin' love pasta. Probably my favorite food of like all time. Oh, mamma mia. Okay. All right, so we gotta go up, down, left, and this way. That was quick. It was pretty quick. I mean, it does, like I said, it, it does help us quite a bit that, um, that since we, since I've already done it once, I, I basically remember everything I'm doing now. We got to go around this way, go up this way, go this way, and then head over here. This doesn't make any sense, but anyway. Um, let's, let's pause for a second. I just ate so much pasta and cheese. Yes, let's go. I suppose it's because I make a pasta made for four all gobbled down. But yeah, right. Mood, I do that too. I make an entire box of pasta and just eat the whole thing myself. Taco seasoning. Oh, wow. That sounds good. Number one rule of cooking pasta. Never too, right? 
there is never, ever too much. Let's actually run a proper save. Proper save there. And save on the my new thing. Dude, what? How big your step? Right. I have a two hollow legs, inevitably. All right, that gives us the key. So now we have to erase all of this and draw a line back up to here. I eat a full box of craft dinner, but I don't even know how much I eat out of a normal box. Ah. Tonight it was a decent amount. Two what? Have a black hole first time, right? Yeah, two hollow legs. Two hollow legs. That is that's what we call them. Um, that's where all the like where does the extra food go? Well, it goes in my hollow leg. Um, and then you open up the map again, and we're gonna draw continue that line all the way down to there. Dang, what that metal! I it, it's it's a mixed blessing. It is a mixed blessing because then I'm like, I gotta eat, to have any kind of energy. Yeah, Tasha, you are feeding two two yeah two two people for sure. All right, let's go. Under the grand order of the whole temple, and your path will become clear. Well, I hope so. Yeet. I take it we're going to need a bunch of arrows for this boss fight. All right, blue light coming up. And the opposite, slow metabolism, like very, very slow. Heart rate and blood pressure below normal low. I never have energy, always tired and very hungry. Heck, my goodness. It is really, really interesting, like really... Um... It, it always amuses, not amuses me, but it's always fascinating how everybody's metabolism is so completely different. Link, that's not... Oh, I, I'm getting really, really tired because I'm trying to use the controller, my keyboard to run. My reflexes are way down right now. All right, let's see. Let's go ahead and open this up. I'm 5'6", 126 pounds, but I move around a lot for work and always on the go. Dang! I've gained 12 pounds so far this pregnancy, and I'm just currently glad they haven't made any comments about that yet. I'm 219 and only 5'2", so I'm expecting more comments. I, well, I mean, I think that, you know, that's to be expected with the pregnancy and everything. Immune system said that my thyroid doesn't belong to me and is attacking it slow. Oh, no! Metabolism is a side effect. Oh, man. That's awful, though. Is this the one I think it is? It is! Alright, this is a cool boss fight. This will be, this will be a fun thing to end, to, to end the note on. Although, I'm pretty sure my 3DS is going to start chugging. Wait. Oh, this is not the boss fight I thought it was. But my, 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 my stream is going to be chugging while we're doing this, because it's... Yeah. Oh boy, this is not the boss fight that I thought it was at all. Alright, where is our critter? I forget how this works. Oh, hey bud. Oh, he's invisible, that's right. Me too, Heidi. Me too. There we go. Just fire all the things. 
Oh, look, there's one left. Dagnab it. Alright, the shell's gonna crack off and then next part of the fight starts. Alright, quick break, quick break. Ooh. Yeah, 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 Tasha, you got the you have the biggest and best excuse, exactly. And some doctors would still complain I've gained weight. Yeah, well, but I mean, that's the thing, though. Like you said, with pregnancy and just life, it's sometimes it's hard not to. I've worked with that disease for, I think, 14 years now. I always fainted when I was a teenager. Doctors just said it was normal. Ooh. I managed to gain weight and seemed to never lose it, no matter what I did. So I went to the doctors and autoimmune stuff. Dang. Oh, true, the BMI. This is true. I know, but, like, still. You just gotta do the best you can, you know, and then... Whoa, the game just lagged. I need to get behind him. Oh, I'm out of arrows. Okay. Not happy with that. Whoa, there we go. Woo! BMI is horse poo. That's the thing. Well, it's. I feel like BMI. I'm not. I'm. I have no. I have no authority or training, obviously, to talk about this stuff. But I feel like BMI. It's a. Uh, it's useful as a general idea of something, but not something to completely base something off of. You know, there's there's people that are healthy that would be considered an overweight BMI, and there's people that are healthy that would be considered an underweight, you know. But yeah, pe here in America, doctors doctors use it like it's a the golden standard, and it's really, you know, I feel like they lean on it a little bit too much. Like, yeah, muscle, fat weight, stuff like that. It's an estimate, right. It shouldn't be the sole target. It's a use, it's, it should be a useful tool. That makes sense. You got more sand for the Phantom Hourglass. Two more minutes. Let's go. Oh, that was actually perfect timing too. Right on the dot. Four hours, let's go. You look just like me. What happened? Something seems weird. This is supposed to be the spirit of courage, but it's a little lethargic. Another Navi. Yes, exactly. It's a little... Calm. I oh, like that. What? Something's odd, but you got the spirit of courage. Maybe now you can find the ghost ship? And another heart piece. Let's go. Alright. First things first. Save state. The animation of the arms, right? Question mark? Let's go! And I think that is where I'm going to call it for the day. Let's go ahead and, like I said, let's do another, another one of those things. Another one of those things. Let's go over here and back. How do we do this? Uh, menu, save. Save, yes. 
Let's go. Toon Link is so goofy. He really is. I love it. I, I really love it. Let's go. All right. So today we we beat the second temple. And then we got halfway through the third temple. And then we did it again and then beat the third temple. So it was actually really productive. We actually did a, we actually did a lot. We got a lot done in the game. And next time we come back, I think we'll be starting to be ready to go chase down the ghost ship. Fucking exciting! Let's go! All right, let's see. Good to spend time with you and everyone here. Yeah, so good to see you again, Ollie. Thank you so much for coming in. I can appreciate that. Uh, let me go ahead and get to my stream ending screen. Oh, some of these credits. So, let me say here real quick, I'd like to thank Cindy for the biddies. I'd like to thank the anonymous donor for the biddies as well with the sound alerts. I'd like to thank Tasha and Macha Lisa and Lulu, my mods, for coming in and hanging out. I want to thank Amdor for the resub and Cindy for giving Ollie that uh, subscription. And I also want to thank Madge for the raid. I had an amazing day. A lot of fun. A lot of fun. And like I said, so tomorrow is going to be Terraria. Community, community Day Terraria. And then Saturday will be Community Day Mario Kart. And then we'll figure out what we're going to do uh, next week after that. I will try to do another repair stream at some point soon. Or maybe an art stream. Something like that. Because I do want to do... I do want to mix it up a little bit. But... Um, I don't have anything right off that I think I can repair on stream easily. But we'll see. We'll see. We'll see if we can find something. Yeah, thank you all so much for coming in and hanging out. Let's let's find somebody to raid. Let's see who is online. Give me a minute. We'll pull up and see who is playing. What? Be cool if we could find someone that was playing some Zelda. Hmm. Actually, um, Jazz is playing Majora's Mask, I think. How long has he been playing? I'll just make sure he's not getting ready to wrap up or anything. Yeah, let's actually give uh, Jazz a raid. He is playing Majora's Mask. He's a really cool streamer. He's a lot of he's a lot of fun to watch, and he often also does like Mario Kart days and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and get that raid started. Make sure I type that right. Jazz C, level of seven. Yep, there we go. So yeah, and just to be a noted, his his channel is always a pretty chill. A lot of a lot of a lot of fun. So it is intended for mature audiences. Um, it's nothing out of this world, but just just so you guys know. And let me go ahead and get out these two raid messages. Hey, yeah, thank you so much. I will. I definitely will. And I hope you all have a wonderful evening too. Oh, Tasha, thank you for that. Uh, I think that second one's raid sub. I need to make a sub raid as well. That will just do the same thing. Yeah, everybody have a wonderful night. I will see you all over on Jazz's stream, and I will see you all tomorrow. Thank you again so much for coming and hanging out, and have a great rest of your Thursday. Bye, everybody.